Hey guys, I gotta interrupt the flex head ratchet series for a, a moment. I had a request for the mountain double box flex head ratchet wrenches compared to the new Tecton double box flex head ratchet wrench sets. And I figured I better do it today because this set is gonna be given away when I reach 3,000 subscribers and I'm knocking at the door. These will be given away. I request for this video, so here we go. The mountain, the model number is MTNRM6. They are spline drive. They are 90 tooth. It's a five piece set, 8, 10, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, and 19 are the sizes it has. It's $170 on Amazon. I've had this set for about, I'm gonna say seven months. I'm not even sure. I have used them. They do have some scratches on them. So they are used, but I have used them. Now the Technin I've only had for two months, just about two months. The model number is WRB96201. And they were around $200. They're a 12 point box, seven piece set, six to 19 mil, 72 tooth. Both made in Taiwan. And like I said, this set, this set is gonna be given away when I hit 3,000 subscribers, I'm pretty close now. I'm in, I don't know, I think I'm 2,930, right around there. So we're pretty close. It could be tonight, it could be tomorrow. I don't know. If you have subscribed, you're in the running for these. It's as simple as that. Whether you subscribed today, yesterday, last week, last month, or last year, you're being in the running for this giveaway, which is coming real, real soon. It could be tonight for all I know. Compared to the Tecton, that was what everybody wanted to see, or at least these two guys, they are the same length. They are the same length, within a half inch or so, guys. Very, very close. The Tecton has that satin chrome finish, which either you like or you don't like. It's as simple as that. I do like it. It is 72 tooth. Getting back to the mountain. The mountain's got that spline drive. Try to show it here for you. It's got that spline drive and zero degree offset. It's got the little box, like a built-in socket, I always call it, like a, like a little na uh, nano socket. So if you're in a recessed area, you can get down in it. And if you flex it up, you can remove the fastener. I do love that. So you can, uh, both sides are a little different. I do like that. They're very, very tight. These things have no play in them. Very little play. And they got the reverse lever. The R92. I, I love these. These are some of my favorites. Why am I giving away? Well, one reason I'm, gonna, I'm giving them away is because I have the K tool, which is a identical. And I have the Icon. I have the V series Craftsman. And obviously these Tecton and about three or four China sets. So it's got the reverse lever in these, which is definitely very nice. A lot of sets don't have that. These are nice guys. We're one of my favorite sets. I'm only giving away because, like I said, I got multiple sets. Very smooth. I've had no issues whatsoever. How do they fit the fastener? The meat and potatoes. Mountain is in the house. Let's take a gander. I had a request for this video, and I, I figured I'd better do it today before I don't have them. They fit very well. They fit the fastener very, very well. Not a lot of slap on their play. They sound good. That 92 is pretty nice. I love the reverse lever. You just don't see that in this price range. Or you don't usually see it in any, any, actually any price range. The tones had it. The tone ones I got, I, I gave away, they had it. Very little back drag. These things are broken in. These are nice little puppies. This is a set you don't give to a friend you don't like very much. This is a set you hang on to. <laughs> but they're very, very nice. I like the chrome. The chrome is uh, impeccable. Feels good in your hands. The ID markers are stamped nice and deep, which I like. Individual part number, very, very nice ratchet. The Tecton, about the same length. The Tecton, the beam is a little bit, uh, the beam's a little bit, bit wider and bigger than the uh, mountain. The mountain's on the left, you can see it right there quite a bit. Tecton's on the top, the beam is thicker and wider, and they are a little bit heavier than the mountain. The play on the Tecton, it's pretty snug. These are only two months old, used very little so far. I think I used them maybe eight times. 
where the mountains got used probably, oh, God, I used them a lot. I'd say 50, 60, 70 times maybe. Very tight tolerances. They're both made in Taiwan. They're not junk. Either set. These are 72 tooth. They got the reverse arrow, which I like. That's my second favorite. I, I always like the reverse lever, but if I can't have a reverse lever, I'd like to see it stamped in which direction to go. And that part is laser etched. They are stamped. ID markings are highly visible. Both sides. Tecton is in the house. Take a gander. They're good looking wrench. I like the satin chrome. Some guys do, some don't. Comes down to preference. Let's put a fastener on the, on the uh, Tecton. Seems to fit pretty good. This is a, this is a 12 point box, whereas the Mountain was spine drive. 72 tooth, it's pretty smooth, no binding, no skipping. Flip it over. These are not bad. Haven't used them a lot yet, but these are these are pretty nice. Very good, very little back drag. I know it's a heavy wrench, but they are these are pretty smooth. They're not even broken in yet, and they're pretty smooth. That chrome, satin chrome, you like it or you don't like it. The mountain got the high polish, the tech you do not. Let's go to a 10 here. 10 miller, 10, 10 uh, millimeter tecton here. Very little back track. These are pretty good for the back track. Very, very snug both ways. No binding, no skipping. It's got that satin chrome finish, which I, I, I like it. Either you don't, like I said, you like it or you don't like it. I like it. I bet a good looking wrench. Let's put a fastener on there. Meat and potatoes, guys, right here, right? Fits pretty good. The tent fits pretty good. Not a lot of play in the mechanism. Pretty smooth. These Tectons are not bad at all. These are some of my favorites already. And like I said, I own a lot of sets. Pretty smooth, guys. Fit the fastener pretty good, and they're pretty smooth. I don't know if you can even hear that. Can you hear that? <laughs> well, they're pretty smooth. Um, I think that the Tekton's probably a little bit better buy. The Tekton are, uh, are $200, but you got seven wrenches, and uh, whereas the Mountain is 170 but you only got five wrenches. So the Tekton is, is a slightly better buy, I think, because you get two extra wrenches. And, uh, again, the model number for the Mountains is... MTNR M6 on Amazon for $170. The model number in Tectons is WRB96201. They were $200, and they came with that tray. And that's a seven-piece set. They're both made in Taiwan. They're both pretty nice. Uh, my final thoughts on this, without making this too long, is the mountains. Well, these guys are going to be gone. These were... One of my favorite sets. These, I like these. Then it was probably the Gear Wrench, and it probably would have been the V-Series Craftsman tied with the Tecton. I got so many of them. But this, this will be gone either tonight or tomorrow, I'm guessing. Not a bad set. Was one of my favorites. I would take the Mountains over the Tecton only because they got the reverse lever, which I like. And they got the little nano socket built on the back side, on one side. I would take these over at Tecton, but it's a pretty close race. I've had these for seven or so months. I've had them for two months. So, again, if you have subscribed, you're going to run in for those mountain double box flex head ratchets. Thanks, everybody that has subscribed. I appreciate your support. Uh, tomorrow, I'll be going back into the flex head quarter-inch drive ratchets. And give me some feedback. Let me know what you want to see for certain kind of ratchets you'd like to see in there. I do mostly mid-level mid tools. I sprinkle in some Chinese in the beginning of every new series, and then I go, I do a lot of mid, and I sprinkle in a couple of high-end tools. So I highly do, I don't usually do Snap-on, Mac, or Matco. I'm not saying I never will. I will at some point put some of those in there. But mostly you're going to see is tacked in, you're going to see Gear Wrench, you're going to see Craftsman, you're going to see Mountain, you're going to see SK, K Tool, uh, 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 and stuff like that. You know, middle of the road tools, Capri, um, stuff like that. 
So let me know what you think about about these uh, about this video and leave a comment below. I always get back to you. And these mountains are going to be going bye bye. Okay, guys, that's it for today. Have a great day.